Yeah, yeah, I am. I am, yeah. But I always said to our player, you get what you deserve, so uh, performance is good, but two reasons we didn't win it. One was the goal that we conceded when we spoke about how they love to take quick free kicks, get their hand on play, and a couple of our players felt it was an unjust free kick, so instead of focusing on the roll, they turned to the ref, boom, the ball's gone. And we concede, so that, that's the only thing really in the game that's got me angry. Uh, and then the second half, in particular, when we started opening them up and playing with a bit more urgency, we got in lots of good counter positions, but final ball wasn't great often enough. Um, and even when we're in good shooting positions, Angus Gunn made some saves, but not as many as he should have been making. So, uh, the two reasons today why we didn't win it. But how, how pleased were you with the <coughs> performances? I suppose you sort of come to a place like Norwich, and it's never a bad point, as they say. Yeah, and I've, it's obviously you, you're doing your homework on the teams, and even the games Norwich have lost here, they still dominate the ball. Uh, but we didn't allow them to do it today. I thought we had the ball for long spells. Um, however, first half and them scoring early ish allowed them to just drop back in so we had no space to play so the message was at half time we had to make the space so we had to be instead of trying to play between lines there's no gaps there we had to make the lines we had to run behind play with urgency move the ball quick more forward passes at pace take more risks and, and the goal comes from that uh, and we're a better side when we play like that anyway is there a feeling in the dressing room, i'm just trying to gauge it that whether you're happy or whether you're frustrated i can't try to weigh up yeah i think Everyone's happy now, except me. I always get frustrated. I want to win every game. Uh, that's something I've learnt about myself. So I'm in there. I'm, like I said, you stop yourself getting too angry about that because that's something you could do something about. Someone letting the ball go under the foot and you concede, they're not meant to do that. But someone switched off today to stop them scoring. They're the things that get me angry. Um, um, and you can win every game of football, but you have to get everything right all of the time, and that's what you try and do. Boy, you scored played really well, didn't you? The lad who scored your goals. Harvey, yeah, Harvey's been doing well. We've got him on loan from Leicester, so um, he's he's one of many who um, pose an attacking threat for us. Um, so, yeah, we've been pleased with him. Lucky goal in a way. I know you talked about perhaps the one or two of the lads were still sort of had their heads in a different space, but there was still an element of fortune about Yeah, with the deflection, yeah, of course, of course. But we don't do a look, you make your own. And <clears throat> they said we should have stopped it at source. And then even after that, that's an area we look to protect all the time where he's actually struck the shot from. Um, so again, when, when they show the players that, they, they, they know what my words will be and, and why I'll be disappointed with that goal. But like I say, I have to constantly look at the bigger picture because how far they've come in such a, a short space of time is, is really, really good and really pleasing. And I, asked, I spoke to the players first in there and asked them and a couple of phrases that came back with was we're a match for anyone now and the other one was we're just going to keep getting better so they, they know where they are they do not mean and they know what it takes so that's why they're doing okay good happy camp by the sounds of it happy bunch yeah good good the, the, the pleased to be we, we want them to work hard but we want them to enjoy themselves and we want that then to be reflected on the pitch um, and it is it is and three unbeaten with a nice little nice little run that's sort of yeah we've had a few now so we've had some uh, good results of late, um, interspersed with some good performances at times, but results have been better. But even before then, we've we've had very good performances. Arguably, some of the best have resulted in losses uh, at home, in particular, and that's just you know na a naivety in, in our young's group is, um, and we have to accept that while we're trying to get better because we're pushing to do things they've never done before in a league they've never been in before. Um, so we have to accept that. We're going to be stretching them beyond what they've been capable of yet. But it don't mean that they can't get there, and I think they're starting to, to believe that now.